Welcome to Isaac. Now on the second channel. Because the second channel is where I put all of the games that I enjoy playing that wouldn't do well on the main channel because of algorithmic reasons. But games I still want to play and hopefully will be entertaining to some people. You know, they got a good amount of views on the main channel. So not like like good amount of views for the second channel standards. But not a good amount of views for the main channel standards, you know. Um, so, hey, if, if this is just going to entertain even so much as a single person, uh, then I'm all right continuing on with it. Particularly because I want to play it as well. And if I can also get, you know, something for this channel, some, some analytics for this channel, why not, eh? <gasps> and now, what I'm going to do it, on this channel is I'm not going to tutorialize as much as I did on the main channel. You know, on the main channel, I thought I've got to make Isaac for... Uh, I, I've got to make Isaac for people who maybe don't know Isaac. Whereas on this channel, I'll just... We'll, we'll mostly use it to have a chat. Uh, this is mostly just going to be me talking to you guys for however many minutes about stuff, you know? Um, but when I talk about the game, I'll talk about any... I won't kind of limit myself to not talking about some of the higher concepts of Isaac in, in the, uh, you know, as much capacity as I can remember them. I don't know if a lot of people just didn't pick up on this when I said it in the first episode, but I've had a lot of people trying to explain to me very basic Isaac concepts that I know. Like, I had, like, prior to the DLC, every single achievement in the game. Um, a million percent. I did it across three save games as well. Uh, but I did at one stage, and just to reiterate, so I don't get a load of advice, like, hey, if you defeat uh, Wrath, you might potentially get bomb -ombs or whatever. Um, I did at one stage set some pretty consistent top 50 and top 20 results in online Isaac. I was quite literally at one stage, one of the best players in the world. Now, let me be clear. That's fucking, that's years ago, <laughs> as you will see as we play. But I do, I'm, I'm actually kind of surprised how many of the slightly higher level concepts I remember. Um, the problem is this new DLC is seriously fucking me up. What I'm probably going to do on this channel is we'll try and do the DLC stuff, right? But we won't necessarily... Unlike on the main channel where I felt like I had to show the game in its best light to try and, you know, get people to... That was brilliant. To get people to enjoy it. Uh, now, I'm just going to do whatever. You know, we're just going to go for a win streak. How about that? If we happen to clear off some of the DLC as we do it, that's great. Um, but for the most part, we're just going to play to win. And if that means we can't get to certain flaws... Um, of the DLC. So be it. I'm not going to restart like I did for a lot of the main channel. Oh, that was fucking close. Now, about those pills then. That's the first thing I can mention. Knowing, getting a health down pill and a health up pill is actually fine. Um, oh, it's not worth blowing those up anymore, is it? That's actually fine because now we've got that knowledge. We know that if we get, you know, say red hearts and we don't want red hearts. Oh, you bastard. Well, that's annoying. Obviously, I don't know how those work. Those are new enemies, so my bad, I guess. Uh, let's use a reroll here. I'm not sure the best method to deal with these rooms. A Stompy actually isn't bad. Assuming there are any tins. Oh, yeah. The perfect example right here of why Stompy's not bad. Right, let's do a bit of a stomp. If we want to come back and get these, we will at some stage. But I'm not going to not gonna sweat it too much. What's I about to talk about? Yeah, I mean, we can always use the health up pill if there's, like, a particular deal with Devil. Or maybe we're going for a red heart run. And we have that knowledge now. So, less of a risk in the future when it probably is going to matter more. And it seems like health is so easy to... Oh, fuck off. It's so easy to lose in the later levels of the DLC. Especially because you have to pay two guaranteed to get to that special floor, you know? we got a lot of keys, though. So, I'm more than happy to open those golden chests. The chance of a deal with the Devil is 46%, assuming we are not hit by the boss. Rainmaker. Rainmaker, I think, was quite difficult. Our speed is also dog shit from that speed down pill. That's proven to be a bit of a pain in the ass. Far more so than I anticipated. Tech X, I love as an item. I've actually had it twice already since we've, um, since we've played. Uh, as in for, like, a series. There you go. No deal with the devil. That's good, though. Speed and damage. Happy to get that. We're back up to more or less the speed we started with. I'm happy to open these as well. Nice. And... The Hierophant. Okay, we'll use that on the next floor. See if we can guarantee that devil deal. Which I so desperately would like. I say that. They're really shite these days, aren't they? 
in my experience. Almost everyone I've had has just been fucking bad. Maybe th maybe there is merit to maybe going full angel deal. Um, everything in here is horrible. You motherfucker. <laughs> I don't normally take Stompy for exactly these reasons, particularly because I don't know what standing on some of these new things will do to us. Is there any way we can get... No, pay money for a battery charge, re-roll it, potentially get half price item isn't worth it, is it really? Right. We've got a mirror floor on this floor, don't forget, so... Potentially get a lot of good stuff here. That's the one reason I like these floors, the downpour floors. You do get a little bit of uh, acceleration. See, I want to jump on everything so we can potentially get a crawl space. But I also don't like standing on things and sometimes getting coins or sometimes getting spiders or sometimes taking just straight up damage. Ultra Pride. Florian and Edmund. Create a self-insert. Now, if we get left hand. Now, left hands. What used to be like pretty much guaranteed guppy, right? Left hand replaces golden chests with red chest. I wonder if they've nerfed it, because they've nerfed pretty much everything in this uh, <laughs> in this version. I think it's fair to say. Oh, those buckets can sometimes give a good amount of coins, actually. Should be standing on those more. Or, again, spiders, as we've seen. Hello there. Guppy? Wow, shit, that was a good turnaround, eh? Let's go one conversion, because Devil Deals now cost... Devil Deals now cost... Um, uh, if you've only got one red heart, it's one red heart, two soul hearts. So we might as well just keep two red hearts. Reroll it into blank card. Blank card we don't necessarily want, so we'll just come back and reroll this in a second. Obviously, I'm not going to take over the D6, especially. Got plenty of coins, though, thanks to Stompy. I suppose that's been a nice benefit. The second we get Guppy, obviously, left half is uh, going in the bin. Although, because Tinted Rocks are rarer and drop less hearts, and survivability is like a big thing, there might be an argument for, um... There might genuinely be an argument for keeping it. I hate the fact that they've nerfed... So you used to be able to get, uh... You used to be able to get... The, uh... Two plays from the Demon Beggar in the same frame of invincibility. Probably nerf that now. Bit of a pain in the ass. Right, let's be careful of a little blob. This guy should be super, super easy to tech X. Ooh, sir. I don't like that. Never a doubt in my mind. Oh, that's good. Tears up and a speed up? Oh, is it not? It's not speed up. It's uh, tears up. You know what I meant, though. Hello. Ability to fly could be really nice. I kind of wish I'd have farmed up a, um, a reroll for this room, but then I thought we've also got the mirror world and the item room, which I don't think we've seen in this floor yet. I'm going to take the ability to fly. Lord of the Pit. Because it seems kind of valuable, to be honest. Also, it's a speed upgrade, right? Let's farm up a reroll. And then head for our item room, then. I suppose we... We should have a look in the shop first. Copy. Oh, we've got, of course, the curse room, too. Ugh. Humbling bottle. Incredible. Give me that. Uh, then if we go out and come back in... Wait. We've changed the way humbling bottle works? It used to be if you left a room and went back into it, like, the bombs would double up. Oh, no. I hope they haven't nerfed that as well. Wait. Humbling bundle. Humbling bundle. How does that... Am I thinking of a different item? Oh, I don't remember. Oh, well. Um, belly button. What's that? Like, free trinket, extra trinket room? I think it's just free trinket, isn't it? We'll take this thing. What are you? Bursting sack. Well, I don't think I really want that. And that's why you shouldn't sit down too fast. What have we got in here? Uh, Yara. Oh my god, we have blank card. We could have cloned a bunch of uh, a bunch of chests. In fact, we still can. Give me you. We're going on an adventure to the mirror worlds, and we're going to blank card Yara a bunch of red chests. Now, it used to be the case that red chest contents were cloned as well. I.e., if you clone a red chest that has hearts in it, you will only get hearts from it. So cloning it beyond that point is a waste of time. Um, well, I suppose you, of course you want hearts. Um, conversely, if you get a red chest with a guppy item in it and clone it, because you can't get two of the same item, you'll just end up cloning... Oh, that's bizarre. 
Oh, the left. <laughs> That's, I suppose that should be the right hand, right? Because we're in the mirror universe. Uh, conversely, if you call a guppy item, it will be any potential item from a red chest. So, could be anything. Even a guppy item. Let's go in the secret room because we know there's a chest in there already, right? In fact, I wonder if it's a chest with an item in it. Oh, interesting. Could it be a guppy item in there? At which point, if we come in here and... Oh, you bitch. Maybe no chests in the... Mirror walls? Oh no, there's one right there. Well, let's pray that we've got lucky here. Blank hardy arrow. Doesn't... Duplicate chests? Uh, okay. Is that enough? What the fuck? Hang on, blank... Wait, so Yarrow doesn't duplicate chests anymore? Are you fucking me? Okay. Well, that makes Yara... Uh, to be fair, he did say he was going to try and take out breaking runs. I.e. runs where you could clone a bunch of items and get super overpowered super easy. Oh, that sucks if they've taken blank card Yara out. That used to be some of the most fun you could have in Isaac. Ooh, I don't like that. I'm not a big fan of that at all. Well, if I'd have known that, I wouldn't have fucking I would have bought the bloody D6. Never mind. Boss room items are generally pretty good. I'm not not pleased about that, though. Edmund, what the hell, man? Little blub. What's he called? Little blub. He should be like big blub. Maybe there is a big blub on future floors. There's an alternate version of this floor that I haven't actually seen yet at all. Placenta. I'll take that. Could be good for playing uh, demon beggars, that type of thing. Man, I'm actually really annoyed by... Blank card Yara not being a thing anymore. Maybe it is just cloning chests. I mean, obviously, Blank Card Yara probably works, but maybe it's exclusively on consumables instead. If I'd have known that, I'd have been cloning... No. Doesn't work on that key either. Blank Card doesn't work with runes? Is that what you're telling me? Oh, man. What does Yara even do? Have I just forgotten what Yara does? It's been that long since I played Isaac. <laughs> Oh my god, that shit. Wait, what the fuck does Yara do? There's nights on the floor in here. What is it? Yara. I need to go look this up. I don't think I ever did clone trinkets. So that was probably a bad use case, but... Oh, that's terrible. I'm not going to get too negative, because I feel like the game's currently got a lot of negativity around it, and I feel like a lot about of that is due to the new difficulty cap. Oh, wow, okay, go on. Epic Vetus. We've got an airstrike now. With lasers. I don't think they've synergized before, did they? They never used to, from what I remember. Well, there's a pretty consistent way to get health, so I'm not going to complain about that too much. We can play this guy. Bonk. Let's grab one of these. Did you just take half a heart from me, then? Half a spirit heart? No, I didn't think so. I'm going to blow you up, because you are, you are dead to me. Right. Second secret room? Maybe there? Hey, there we go. Man, I like this combo. This is nice. Oh, well, I could have played the shit out of that demon bag. Never mind. Tumbling bundle. Actually working as intended there. Maybe it just doesn't affect previous drops to make it harder to break shops. Maybe that's it. Right, give me a second. I'm going to go take a Lisa memory stick of the Dark Souls episodes. I'm not editing these, so you can watch the screen a second. <laughs> she said, how long are you working for? I don't think she heard my reply, though. It was a bit pointless, really. Right, Flooded Caves 2. We need two bombs for this war, don't we? I don't know why. I genuinely thought for a second we were going to die then, because we're the lost. But obviously, we're not the lost anymore, genius. Right. Let's be careful. Epic Feast is good. Because I can focus on dodging. Most of the time. Oh, okay. Guppy, guppy. Guppy, guppy, guppy. What are those spiders? <gasps> They're enemy spiders. Why are they a weird color like that? What the hell? They were like... They're kind of like, um... You know, like one of those pretty fly shines to it. Weird. Yara, you're shit now. Friendship ended with blank card Yara. Crooked Penny is my new best friend. Let me guess. Crooked Penny probably doesn't work either. 
The moon. We might as well go to the secret room. Oh. <laughs> well. Mini charge. Yeah, so we record. Uh, we're also doing, just to catch you up with my catalog right now. Uh, main channel, we've got Rimworld. Obviously, this channel, we've got Skyrim. And now also Isaac moving over to here because I still want to play it. But it's not good enough to not. It's not good enough to tank my main channel. Um, ooh, this is this is a situation where I don't like Dr. Fetus. Um, what was I about to say? Yeah, and then on the Elise and Sam channel, we've got uh, Dark Souls 2 and T-Review. T-Review, we're, we're, we're limiting them a bit more because they got a bit rambly. And I want to cut them down into 30 minutes of really good content rather than an hour of, well, I guess, I mean, 50% less good content, right? Assuming it holds up. Um, oh, you bitch. Fucking Stompy. I hate it. I hate Stompy. I would never have taken that if I didn't know what it bloody was. It's too easy to forget yourself, especially when you are flying and trying to aim. This is exactly the situation where Epic Fetus can fuck off. Please. Just work with me here. Oh, God. Okay, there's one. There's two. Oh, that would never end. And because we've got, like, so many things on right now, I guess we can tell we've got another few floors of it. And we're going to get double coins as well. Because we've got so many things on, we're having to record Dark Souls, like, really late and in, like, blocks of two. So we'll do two hours of recording at a time. It means it's currently 6.24 a.m. Fucking hell, I'm getting absolutely peppered. Just absolutely destroyed. 6.24 a.m. We've just finished recording Dark Souls. Rimworld has finally just finished uploading. That won't work. Oh, no, I'm all right. <laughs> I think I'm okay. And uh, obviously, I've still got to finish this run. Skyrim, I generally record first every day, just because that goes out the earliest, so I can record that one first and still get feedback and everything. Rimworld, I might push back an hour again. I pushed back a little bit to coincide with um, America's Daylight Saving Times. Oh, Jesus. Can we use that effectively? Maybe. If we get, like, Dark Judas. The sun. Two of hearts. Let's take Yaren here. If we get Dark Judas, yes. If we get Guppy, no. Um, God, I, I don't like the doctorate. False PhD. It's a health upgrade in exchange for worse pills. Oh, thank you. Oh, but if we take a bad pill, we get an evil heart? Is that what it does? If so, that's not too bad. Maybe. Um, what do we want for the next floor? I'm going to take Suicide King, see if we can do something cool with it. Why am I using my bombs when we could just use Epic Fetus? Then again, why not use my bombs when we've got Epic Fetus? Sumbling Bundle, not all items now. Because there was two coins, then a one coin in there. That's going to make Greed Mode laugh with some of the new characters, isn't it? Soundtrack here. I've said it before. Uh, Nightmare Before Christmas. You hear that? It's not just me, right? What have you got for me? You want coins for charge. I might come back to you. We'll talk later. Is it versus lust? Oh my god, it's just occurred to me. On the first floor, we didn't go down a floor, did we? I went down the regular trap door and not down through the DLC door. Never mind. Thank god we're at least on this one. Stompy, you can fuck yourself. I don't think you're going to get me to walk into that. Oh. <laughs> I do like the lasers from Dr. Fetus. That's cool. Obviously, it's not just Dr. Fetus, but... I suppose some... I've got I to gotta try and blow a lot of things up here. I need a lot of health. Oh, you guys can fuck yourselves. It took me 20 minutes to deal with two of you. I'm not a big fan of that. Oh. Don't hawk at me. Okay, we're fine. I'm a little apprehensive about this guy in playthrough. And the reason I'm a little apprehensive is because we have played... About as many episodes as we play, played Oblivion for. Uh, and we've done... Two quests from the main quest, uh, along with one guild. <laughs> oh my god, another suicide gang. Nine lives. With the left hand, it's possible. I don't know that I'd want to throw away that much stuff, though. That's like a lot of hearts we're potentially throwing away there. Let's leave it on the floor. Any, any spirit hearts we get going forward, we'll leave on the floor in the hopes that we get dead cat. 
And then we can use double suicide king. Okay, leave that then. Just don't let me forget that I've left things on the floor, especially not on a curse of lost floor. Right. This is the what is the boss fight? Through here. Hello there. Great Gideon again. I get him like all the time. Is he the guaranteed boss on this floor? It would kind of make sense, I guess, given that next floor you're supposed to obviously sacrifice health to get down to the next floor. The mausoleum. So I wonder if they throw this kind of wave-based survival at you very literally to, to try and test your survival. Because that way, if you lose too much health doing it, you can't get down to the next floor, which is a really fun gameplay loop. <laughs> I get it. It's supposed to be a difficult game. I just don't like having to spend your resources to get to fresh new content, you know? And there's obviously a lot of new challenges in this too. Those I might just do in my own time. Because if it's anything like the Afterbirth challenges, Jesus, like the speed challenge, that can fuck off. Oh, you're an enemy. Not bad. Oh, Jesus, come on. There we go. Okay. Careful. Oh, don't want that. Oh, he blew up his own friends. Um, well, let's not take that. Again, because if we can get... If we can get Dead Cat, there's a potential for a double Suicide King play. So let's go and explore a little bit more first. So we can find... Well, there's a potential for double Suicide King play and a Curse Room play, which is something I never, ever do. I've already been in there. Okay, this way then. Start the floor. Let's go in the Curse Room. Never know. Oh, here we go. Dead Cat. Watch. Dead Cat. Dead Cat. Bollocks. I know I shouldn't have picked that up, but it's half a heart. Just if we went, went back in there to pick it up, it probably wouldn't be worth it. Okay, careful there. Nice. Are you a wizard? Ah, oh, so you take bad pills, it gives you... Okay, hang on, that could be really good. Assuming that's how it works and I'm not just, I don't know, getting some... Ooh, Capricorn. Oh no, that's another item that could give us health back. I'm holding on for the dead cat play. I really am. This could be the minecart, though. Yeah, I don't think we could get a... Damn. Okay. Well, look. Let's head in. You never know. After we clear this, we might get... I don't know. Maybe we'll get uh, a red chest spawn. Maybe that'll be dead cat. Second secret room might have... Might be the second secret room. You know, the one that spawns all the golden chests. Could be full of red chests. Then we dead cat. We double suicide king curse room. We pick up Capricorn old bandage. Then we're in a fantastic place for health. If not, worst case scenario. Oh no, we've got to pick up Capricorn and old bandage, eh? Go on, Eliza. This, I think when you're used to it and the kind of permutations of rooms that can appear, I think it's probably not going to be that difficult, to be honest with you. It's the, it's the poop rooms. Oh no, it's these rooms that fuck me up. The poop rooms aren't nearly as bad as this one. The bomb throwing physics shit is horrible. Come on, one more, one more, one more. How the fuck are you supposed to do that like this on like DS, you know? Right. So we can go, oh there we go, good shit. And bloop. And bloop. Okay, this one actually wasn't too bad. Obviously we're not done yet, but we're getting there pretty. Oh, Alright, you gotta open the next boy up with this boy. Very nice. Good shit. Almost there. It was a bit unnecessary, but that's okay. There was a button back there. What was that for? Fuck, I hope it wasn't for this room. I'm just going to walk through. I don't care. We're done. Hey. Any chance of a red chest, mother? So let's go back to the boss fight. Let's start looking for the second secret room. We could even go in that boss trap room of our own accord by weakening ourselves right up. Because the chances of that being... Oh, having a chest in it is guaranteed, right? Or an item. Right, so there's our secret room. Second secret room. Let's look for obvious places here. Might as well bomb all the kind of potential places on the way through. I'm really holding out for this play. I know it's a silly play that might not ever happen. But, you never know. This is the boss fight. Oh, no. Right, this one? You. 
Hmm. Here? Can't be attached to another room, so it can't be there. Could be here. Could be here. Can't be, because it's attached to another room. There it is. Nothing. Okay. Well, a load of consumables. So now, what do we do then? I'm going to weaken us up and go into the boss trap room. We've got stars cards. We can we can teleport out. That's good. So let's curse room our health away. Go into the boss trap room. See if we get a chest that just happens to contain dead cat. Look, it's not an unlikely chance. It used to be 15% for a guppy item. And then obviously a 1 in 6 chance from there. Oh, sorry. That's Wrath of the Lamb. Um, careful there. Nice. Nothing. Okay, that's that's our first attempt gone. We can get some more black hearts, though. I suppose the experimental pill. Uh, that's actually really good for us. Um, probably wouldn't count as a negative pill, would it? So let's go into the boss trap room. Stars card out. Fuck. Mum's here. Reroll. That'll do. Okay. So overall, it wasn't great. But let's consider what we've got here. We got a shot speed up. Which we probably wouldn't have got if I hadn't have gotten this desperate. I would never have done that and gone in there if we'd got Dead Cat earlier. So that's a positive. Capricorn we've got. Um, we've got a shitload of hearts just kind of lying around on this level. We've got Old Bandage as well. In terms of a red heart run, that's alright. Old Bandage especially. So I don't think this went too badly. It was a massive gamble. It didn't really pay off, but it wasn't awful. I guess I'll take suicide. Actually, you know what? Let's get some more pills from this too then. Health down in exchange for a black heart. Probably not worth it, is it? What? Are both of those health downs? Oh my god, we got two health down pills. They can fuck off then. Get out of here. I don't want to accidentally take one. Although, a health down pill, it used to be the case that a health down pill, if you remember, when you. Where were all those other hearts I spawned? Curse room was one. Oh, I don't remember. Um. It used to be the case that if you lost... It's the same we take a devil with deal on the next floor. We could potentially turn it into a health up pill. Hmm. Right. Other spirit hearts. Were they in the second secret room? I swear we spawned more than this. Okay. I'll take one of... I'll take both of those with me for utility, potentially. Let's go in here. What are you? I'm excited. Is that a bad pill? I suppose so, because it makes enemies move faster, doesn't it? Okay. Let's go down a floor. That was a lot of meandering there. I was I was trying to be fancy with it. On we go. Down to... Oh. Fine. And another health down pill. Bloody hell. Hey, fake PhD. You know what? I thought it was shit. Genuinely might save the run here. We got a chest room here. You give me dead cat now, I'll cry. That's okay. I would have said, you shit, but obviously I'd have been happy to take it, because then we could have potentially used our health up pill, as it would have become at that point. Bonk. I will admit, I like the ability to fly in combo with Dr. Fetus. That's a real... That's got a real nice play to it, you know? Alright. Is this gonna... I was gonna say, maybe the mob trap room will open for us. Go on. Oh! Damn it. Oh! It was a guppy item, man. We don't have to fight this room. Good shit. Well, that puts us two-thirds of the way there. I'm excited. How dare you. I assume that was I'm excited anyway. I really have no idea. Bonk. Wait, I'm excited persists between floors. Look down. I mean, our luck's already zero. We haven't got any luck-based effects. Did that not spawn a... Oh my god, I wonder if that didn't spawn a heart because we were flying over a gap. That would be bullshit, wouldn't it? Seems like the type of thing they'd do. <laughs> what do these things do? They're just decorative plinths. Oh my god, I'm excited to persist between floors. This is horrible. Worst day of my life. I haven't unlocked the alternate floor for this room yet, so still another boss that I haven't fought on the mausoleum. I fought the, con the, the, the posthumous horn a couple of times. Oh, I like those. Little, little brims. Well, right, here we go. Health? Oh! <laughs> so generous. Oh, those little brims kind of follow you around like a like an able type situation. 
Interesting. Oh, I don't like those. Oh, it's like a Gemini. Oh, I couldn't fire then because I was... Blew the door open. I couldn't fire because I was feared. There we go. And fuck off. Those are weird. I like those. Jesus. Okay, we've got way too much health now. Left hand suddenly top tier. What are you? Oh, no. Is that a bad thing? It doesn't work. It doesn't do anything. Although... Look at the visual effects coming off of that. More eyes gives you the chance to fire shots randomly out of like anywhere on your body from what I remember. Seeing in uh, like a Twitter preview that um, Tyrone posted. <gasps> That's what I was about to say. That means might mean that occasionally we fire lots of rockets simultaneously. Oh shit. That might be accidentally high tier. Fuck. Okay. Well, I like that. That's cool. Hello there. And you can piss off. Excellent work. Let's go to the shoppy. Um, I mean, that's good. But we're not really struggling for any consumable right now. What's this bad pill then? Another health down. <laughs> My favorite flavor of health down pill is yellow. Nice. Not nice, but I mean, we can pick up that heart. Does spikes hurt you when you fly? I don't know why I thought they did. To be honest, I wouldn't be surprised if they bloody did in this version of Isaac, to be completely frank. Right. No, Bomb Lord. I was going to say, if he blows himself up with his own troll bombs, and it's just a rinse and repeat type, type situation. He's a moon to be blown up, eh? Nothing. I was already hoping for a guppy. Muslim 1 is not the mum fight, is it? So let's backtrack a little bit. Let's pick up that heart. Let's check that other room as well. Oh, I thought that'd be a secret room then. Could be adjacent to the shop. Hello. Man, I like that combo. Oh, Jesus. Okay. Generous boy. If only we actually had a good shop. Shops are half price. If we, we need a shop with one of the recycling machines. 72.5% chance to deal with the devil now, so... Could do something nice with that. Oh, my God. I wonder how many potential shots we can get from that. It obviously ties to your luck stat, and I lowered our luck stat specifically to get some health. I'm excited. Sure. And a luck down. Well, now that we've got a status or a luck-based effect, I would rather... Rather not throw that away. This is a cool run. We've had a lot of cool runs in, in a short period of time, to be honest. Uh, blow the shopkeeper up. We've already done that. So that won't give us anything. The tint on the spiders is really weird. It's throwing me off. Right. Let's see what... Oh, I suppose the reason it would be harder to unlock the mausoleum bosses is because... Yeah, I fought you many times before. Um, is because of one of them actually being mum, right? Oh, no. Our shots still take as long to fire. But obviously, the enemies move faster. Attack more rapidly. Not that it matters, because, you know, I am really good at games, actually. Marrow. Do we want that? No. We don't really want that either. It's a lock up. No, no, no. Hang on. That's all right. It's, it's better than the other one we had. In pretty much every way. Granted, if you take red heart damage while you got a bone heart, it doesn't obviously take away your deal with the devil. So that would be a situation where you might want to take one over the other. But, conversely, we've also got all the fucking health in the world right now. This is a good run. I've got, I've got a good feeling about this. The soundtrack turns into Sonic. I love that. Speed down. Trade speed down for health? I mean, it's better to carry that than two health down pills, right? Oh, no. Where are they? About there? Oh, come on. Just give me a chest. We're one item off of Guppy. Then we can be firing multiple bombs. And we can get ourselves a little Guppy. Oh, you bitch. What a horrible boy. Oh, my God. <laughs> I am speed. Damn, I'm excited. Has it always persisted? I just thought it was a single floor thing. Maybe I accidentally took one on the last floor and didn't realize. Like a fool. I don't think I've taken one on this floor, though, have I? Whatever. Doesn't really matter. Bonk. Not like these guys. Because if they're not... Honestly, I think those guys are easier. The brimstone ones are so much easier than the ones who fire the horrible worms. Because the worms obviously block shots. Oh my god, it's daylight outside. I was like, there's a light behind me. Why is that? Oh, because it's fucking 7am. Oh, the power. 
The power. Oh my god, look! Oh! The lock upgrade. Oh my god, the lock upgrade. I was going to say the gop upgrade then, but the game robbed me of my own joke. Jesus, this is good. Hello there, bitch. <laughs> Stinky. Do we want, even want to blow up those fires? I suppose we could get a little bit of health from it. Was it like 10% now? Down from 25? A lot of the Isaac stats I remember are Wrath of the Lamb stats. It keeps throwing me off. Like the guppy chest thing. Okay. Nothing. Oh, they make guppy items less frequent. I don't see why they do that, but they might. Watch this. Dead cat. Boom. Son of a bitch. Shots be down. Happy. Oh. You don't want to give me a health for that. What's this one? Amnesia? Fine. What's it you need to do on this floor? Nothing. You just need to hack open the door, don't you? I was going to say maybe that amnesia will bite me in the ass because I won't remember the way to go. But it's our item room. Evidently not. Bumbo? Sure, I'll take Bumbo. Bumbo won't coin. I never played Bumbo the game. I meant to, but I never got around to it. Oh, you can run into those. Wait, what? So because I fly, I can run into a rock and... That's fine. Make any fucking sense. <laughs> All right, here's Guppy. Oh, we potentially re-roll it. I don't really want that, to be honest with you. Go on. Well, I definitely don't want Spider Anus. Shop, give me a re-roll. Shop, I'm pissed off at you right now. Shop, please. Please, my son. Erase thine enemy. That's rubbish. My son, consume. Well, it's something. Uh, I think I would rather re-roll this, because that could be anything. Oh, it could be kidney bean. Oh, sorry, mega bean. Damn it. We've got two items we need to re-roll. We... Oh, we got battery charges though. We're good. Oh, a little Loki. I'll take it. Fine, that's all right. It's not great, but I'll take it. 33 minutes. We are way behind schedule. 10 minutes, especially with like this type of run. But I think my thoroughness has paid off because look at us now. Huh? You're fucking dead. <laughs> I, wasn't, I wasn't fucking kidding around, pal. Right, let's hack that open. Just in case going into the deal. Ah, you bitch. Deal with the devil affects it for whatever reason. Trade a red heart for a black heart and a speed upgrade. Oh, I'm looking forward to this, this uh, mother fight. Look at that. Here we go. Because I think we are going to slay. Die. Especially if we get one of those big hits like we had before. Like Jesus. Ugh, stinky. What a dirty hole. All right. Here we go. Into the corpse. Uh, oh, there's a treasure room here. You got guppy for me? Guppy, 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 guppy. Fucking really? Well, we got some backup health if I get my ass handed to me. Guppy? Bollocks. New anus. I want to feed my bumbo son. Oh, I don't like those. Jesus. Oh, no. Monstro, what happened? Oh, no. Oh, these are not fun. Okay. We good? A coin. Oh, I should have given that to my bumbo son. What a thief. Christ. <laughs> Talk about over the top. No, I'm not doing that on these floors. Sorry. Not interested. Especially not because we don't need the health. Oh, my God. I wonder how many shots you can get simultaneously. I imagine it ties to your luck stat. Not only the chance of them firing, but also the amount that fire. Probably both correlate to your luck stat, don't they? You shit. That's going to get me on the way back, isn't it? Ooh. Careful there. This is a very powerful run. I'm not going to pull the wool over my eyes and say, oh, I'm doing so well. Are these just scaled up versions of the other one? Or are these actually unique enemies? I'm not going to hang around to find out. Oh, Rotten Baby. What happened? Well, they did to Rotten Baby. They turned him into a real man. Oh, my God. Just give me Guppy. That'll do. I'll take that. I could have kept re-rolling that, I guess. But we're Leviathan. Hey. High chance to deal with the devil. But Gluttony? Why did Gluttony look so strange? What have we got? Health down. Amnesia. No, I don't think I will. 
Come on, just give me a guppy. Oh, this is absurd. Oh, my God. <laughs> it never ends. I love that. That's a nice combo because we can just fire out a shitload of bombs, aim it wherever, and basically kill everything. Oh, man, these guys are fucking tanky. They can take a Dr. Fetus to the face. Stop that. Stop spawning friends. Can I have some coins for my son? He's worked very hard over the summer, and he's saving up for a PlayStation 5. <laughs> Don't be silly. He's saving up for a NVIDIA graphics card. <laughs> Don't be silly. Saving up for a stable future. Lockdown. I'm excited. I don't think I want either of those. Oh, my son's so handsome now. Look at him. Ugh. Ah, eat. Eat my child and be merry. Um, let's keep exploring rooms because I'm a, I'm a guppy boy. A charmed frowning gaper appears. Oh, from Pokey Pokey Go, whatever it's called. <gasps> Small rock. Speed down and a slight damage upgrade when we're already doing ridiculous amount of damage. Oh, I can't. I'm sorry. Maybe in the future when we get ridiculous runs, I'll do it. I, I, I hope you understand the temptation to press that then was honestly absurd. Chest? That's not a chest. That's a bunch of poo. Oh my god, that's even more. Oh my god, that's even more. Okay, we're good. What do you do? Give me free HP by the sounds of it. Oh no. Oh, that's a lot of them. That's a that's a tough room if you haven't got very good speed. That's a lot of damage. A charmed one tooth appears. It's the bat. Oh, there he is. Oh, this is a stinky room. It's like a dead heart or something. Full of flies. Vile. So we've got to re-roll potential pedestal on this floor. But 36% chance we deal with the devil? Kind of surprised. Wouldn't bank on it, though. I'm excited. I'm excited versus speed down. There's an argument that speed down is a better proposition if we're just doing it to get health, you know? But if we do get a deal with the devil, we might be able to flip one of these health down pills into a health up pill. Because we're not going to be able to get the Polaroid either way, right? Chimera. Oh, I haven't fought you before. Well, I guess I'll never find out what you do. Oh, meaty, meaty. Whore of Babylonian. Well, there's a lot of hearts. So I could be persuaded to take that. Um, we've got a lot of hearts just kind of passively on the on the map. Uh, we can also take this. We can also take this. Because we're not going to get rid of all of our red hearts, right? So what difference does it make? we got a bunch of hearts lying around, right? Oh, they're in the curse room? We can take one. No, you can't. Because on the way out, you take some damage. All right, never mind. We can take a bunch of these pills, but I don't think it matters. Um, secret room. I don't think it matters. It's all right. I was thinking we could, we could potentially get a reroll for that pedestal. I think I think we're a bit beyond that now. Plenty of HP still, so that's good. Still not guppy, despite the fact I've opened what feels like more chests in this run, one run, yeah, one run than I've ever opened in any other previous Isaac run combined. Fucking Jesus, there's so many troll bombs out of them these days. If I could get some currency for my son, that'd be lovely. He's very, he's very hungry boy. He has a, he has an appetite problem. Just, just keeps shoving Doritos into his mouth, but he just, just always says, "Mommy hungry, please feed me." Oh, he dropped coins for me, which he's gonna go and then pick up. It's like when you buy your mum for, oh, careful Mother's Day, a, a brand new Nintendo Wii. Can I play it sometimes, mum? Oh, thank you, Guppy. Motherfucker. These troll bombs, they're so frequent now. No. Hmm. I did want to resurrect, but now it's a bit like the ship sail, pal. It's also not the resurrect I want. I don't like that. When threatened, he will look... No, oh, that was for my son. When threatened, he ejects his stomach at you like a fucking... Like a flat one. Vile. Man, I'm loving these kind of multiple shots. I wonder how that eye effect synergizes with other items. I assume when you've got it normally, it just fires tears in different directions, right? I've only ever seen it... Like, Ty Tyrone did like a... Like a two-minute preview on uh, Twitter. 
Oh, did I say two minutes? It was literally like five seconds. Um, so it, you weren't really able to tell quite how it worked. Just enough to infer. I'm taking a lot of damage on this floor because I'm getting complacent. Oh, they made Ultra Greed look different, didn't they? Oh, these are for my son. I'm sorry. I keep forgetting about you. Well, he's maximum level now, so I don't really care. Come along, Bumbo. Bort? What kind of name is Bort? Right, what have we got in here? Oh, I don't like those. Those don't look very Isaac-y, do they? Is that just me that thinks that? You look a weird art style compared to your regular Isaac boy. I also don't like these guys. They're just like bigger versions of other enemies. They seem like they're a bit more... Jesus, I gotta be careful with this damage. Especially because these fucking chests now only spawn troll bombs. They're fucking things. Oh, Christ. Don't get my ass handed to me. Yeah, give me that. Give me that. Give me that. Give me one of those. It's okay. We're doing all right. I'm getting very distracted by my own thoughts. <laughs> I'm getting complacent as well. Ooh, crow heart is good, but I don't need it. I still want Guppy. I'm holding out. And given they've nerfed chests. Fuck it. I mean, maybe the left hand is better than just getting golden chests at this point, eh? We've got way more health from that than we would have ever got from golden chests, I assume. I don't know the current drop rate, so I can't say that with all the confidence in the world, but... That's a jug of lemonade? Oh, it's like lemon party, but like... Better? Maybe that is lemon party, but they've changed it. Bonk. Well. <laughs> wild gaper appears. <laughs> Good one. Well. Should we fight the boss then? So I'm going to do the speed down. I'm not going to heart out of it. Yeah, that's what I was going to say. Now all we've got to do is rely on our luck stat. Kapow. Oh, Jesus. The damage is actually... I don't know where to stand to avoid these attacks. I'll be completely honest with you. Okay. See, like, that one's quite, quite tricky, isn't it? Bumbo fucking annihilated it. Good work, Bumbo. It could be difficult to hit it like this. I won't lie to you. Come on. What's it doing? Oh, don't like that. Come on. Where's my luck? Nice. That was good for you. Well, this attack seems a lot easier to dodge than like literally all of her other attacks. I did take a bit of damage there, I will admit. Yikes. Don't like this. Will you fucking die? Oh, man. I'm getting my ass handed to me again. Is it dead? Did I kill it on half a heart? Christ, that was tough. We got Meat Cleaver and Isaac's Awakening for the, um... For the achievements there. I also got Seeing Double and a Strange Door. Okay. What the hell caused some of those to fire then? Let me just quickly alt tab out and see what we got for that. Um... Right, where was it? Binding of Isaac. I've got the Steam Overlay enabled because it fucks with... Strange Door, where could it lead to? Okay. And they've got Isaac's Awakening unlocks a new challenge. Meat Cleaver, complete the corpse with Isaac. Seeing Double, unlock a new challenge. Uh, Jacob and Esau, you're just like your father. Don't know what that means. Strange Door appears. Is that somewhere else we can go in the game after this then? Weird. Does it take us to the chest or is that game over? Oh, it's it. Let's watch the Vision X. I've not watched this before. Give it to me now. This is what you think of me? This is what I am to you? A monster? No, no, Mom. I just... After all I've done for you, this is how you view me? You think I'm a monster, Isaac? I'll show you a monster! No, no, please! You are just like your father. I can't even look at you. How could you? You are just like him. Oh, it's the start. There you go. Wow. Look at that. 
Oh no. And he turns to Satan. <laughs> wow. There you go. Bunny Visit Repentance Team. Game by Edmund McMillan and Tyrone and Victor. Whoa. This is going by a bit fast. I can't read all this, but you know. You know how it is. Not your Sagittarius. Uh, I recognize that name. I don't know why. What's that music playing in the background, eh? Weird. I wonder if there's anything hidden in the credits if you, like, slow it down. Oh, it's Jesus Loves You. I can hear it now. I've got to turn down quite low, to be fair. Special thanks. Good work, those people. There's a bunch of other people. Very nice. Good work, people. Well done. What can I help you with? I wanted to get my phone and also to say hello. Have you just finished your run? Yeah, I just beat it. Hello, yeah. everybody. I hope you enjoyed the run. They don't enjoy you. Your interrupt look. Now she's dead. She's there. Oh, she's an angry lady. I'm going to have to speak really loud because Sam's microphone is good for him and not for me. So now i got to do a load of bloody challenge runs. Oh, the challenge is shit, though. I'm probably just going to do those off camera because these are... <laughs> they're always they're always so shite. So there's, what, another eight challenges there? Yeah. Yeah, there's eight challenges. Scatman, Isaac's Awakening, and seeing double. Let's, let's open this one up, see what it's like. I'm not going to do it now because that went on for 52 fucking minutes. Oh, my minutes. God, that's a long boy. Oh. Sort oh. Of, oh, it's Legend of Zelda. Oh, didn't they already do that, though? Da, da. For a different chat, let's do da, 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 when, you're, when you're playing Well, Legend this is Isaac's Zelda. Awakening, though. So he's got sword and shield. Like, Link's Awakening. Well, I thought that he'd, he'd, they'd already done this for a different challenge. But they've done something similar. Ba, 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 da, ba, da, ba. What was the um was the original sword? Sword of Justice, isn't it? Spear of Justice. Spear of Justice. It was never this good. I want to know what this item is, because this is great. Maybe is they've it? upgraded it. Maybe they've, yeah. maybe they've buffed it. What does the spacebar item do? Oh, you pick up things and throw it. It's a it's band of strength, literally from Legend of Zelda. Oh. It's not I, very good. I don't know how you throw things with it. Yeah, I don't know how you thro throw things with it. Oh, there you go. You aim it in a direction. Oh, this seems like quite an easy challenge. <laughs> to be honest. Well, maybe we'll do this one at some point. Yeah. 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 Can I throw a poo? <laughs> you can throw a poo. Right, we're not going to do this whole thing now. I just wanted to... Dingle. Yeah! Get roasted. I wonder if it drops items. If it also drops items. Oh, man. This is going to be an easy run. All right. For the future. Bye. Bye.